With accusations flying as Augusta leaders fail to name a city administrator again. George Escala has the story. After 12 weeks being out following back surgery, Alvin Mason was back in the commission chambers and ready to vote for a permanent city administrator. My position has always been clear. It hasn't changed. Uh, if you recall, I was the one who nominated Tamika Allen the last time. Allen was at the meeting. So were the mayor and five commissioners supporting her for the job. But not there were the five commissioners supporting interim administrator to Kia Dows. This preventing a quorum meaning no vote could be taken. They decided not to show up, um, just kind of politics of Augusta. We want to see Augusta move forward. We want to see this um, government operate much more efficiently. And what you're seeing here today is one more reason why we can't do that. One of the commissioners not there was Jordan Johnson, who was at work and blamed the mayor for not giving enough notification on the meeting, adding he wasn't playing political games. That's bogus to even suggest that as political. At the end of the day, we did not receive notification in decent enough time to be able to attend this meeting. Later, Commissioners Francine Scott and Tony Lewis did arrive for the scheduled committee meetings, but left and prevented a quorum again when another vote on administrator was attempted. Don't hide from it. Come on down and, and do your job. Your constituents are out there. They're looking. They're wanting to see who's showing up and who's not. The mayor saying the issue is not going away and said commissioners will be taking up the administrator vote at their meeting next week. In Augusta, George Escala, WJBF News Channel 6.